fighting India's freedom struggle were taken. It was while living here that Mohandas Gandhi came to be known as Mahatma Gandhi. And this is the symbol of self-reliance, the spinning wheel, Charkha. The Charkha was Gandhiji's great tool for empowerment and dignity of labor. President Trump and the First Lady giving it a try. It also has great spiritual significance. Gandhiji used to say one hour spent in spinning would be equivalent to an hour in self-development for the spinner. It's very meditative when you spin the chakra. In the meanwhile, Motera Stadium is abuzz with excitement. Lata Ben explaining how the yarn is spun. People trying the charka for the first time it can be a little unnerving, but once you get used to it, you understand <coughs> what Gandhiji meant when he called it the physical embodiment of his constructed program as a representation of Swadeshi, self-sufficiency, and at the same time, interdependence because the weave is at the center of a network of cotton growers, carders, weavers, distributors, and users. It also embodied the dignity of labor, equality, unity, as all volunteers were to spin each day, and finally, independence was achieved. In fact, it has been called the livery of our freedom. That is what Khadi signifies for us. A few moments of introspection, <coughs> trying to absorb the essence of Mahatma Gandhi, his teachings, and his philosophy. It's hard to imagine, but this is exactly how the Mahatma would have sat here with his international visitors. He too had a great sense of humor. Interestingly, Gandhiji could write from both his hands. And sitting here in the veranda, he would meet a lot of world leaders and other guests, as we now see the special visitor today, the American president, Donald Trump, now penning his thoughts in the visitor's book. Foremost in the movements launched by Gandhiji from this very place, the Sabarmati Ashram was the 385 kilometer salt march from Sabarmati Ashram to Dandi on the South Gujarat coast. Interestingly, Gandhi Smarak Sanghalya Sabarmati is open on all days of the year from 8.30 in the morning till 6.30 in the evening Daily about two to three thousand footfalls, and on a holiday, Sunday, weekend, that in 
increases to about 5,000 footfalls. Mahatma Gandhi believed in an openness. He used to say, I do not want my house to be walled on all sides and my windows to be stuffed. I want the cultures of all lands to be blown about my house as freely as possible. But I refuse to be blown off my feet by any. This perhaps is the openness that he talked about. The people of all cultures, all traditions came here. The three monkeys of Mahatma Gandhi speak no evil, see no evil, hear no evil. These were originally given to Mahatma Gandhi by a Japanese monk and they became an essential part of his philosophy. And those philosophies, Jasleen, are still very relevant and encourage each one of us to ensure that we imbibe the core values of humanity, truth, non-violence, love, compassion, service, sacrifice, forbearance and equality.